Hey guys, it's Ashley with 3R Sales and Service. Today we're taking a look at the 12 volt soft wash box assembly with the hose reel. This features the Titan hose reel. It's a 12 inch reel, full frame. It has the stainless steel manifold. Uh, it's an aluminum construction. We have this, the hand crank reel, and then we've got the locking pin on the opposite side here so you don't have to worry about your hose unwinding while you're going down the road. It's on a 24 by 18 diamond plate aluminum box, uh, just to make it more corrosion resistant, but also give you a little extra room for storage if you wanted to keep extra components in there. The box does lock, so you can keep everything secure, and it opens really easy. Let me put this here. It's got a hinged door and a seal to keep everything protected. And now that we're inside the box, um, we have our big Group 24 battery box uh, right up front here. This will fit your deep cycle battery that you'll use with this system. The uh, pump assembly, we have our Remco 100 PSI, seven gallon per minute pump. And then we've got the accumulator tank just off to the side there. Uh, the nice thing that we do with these pumps is we use the quick connect connections. So if you ever had to change a pump or you needed to do um, a quick diagnostic, uh, <laughs> quick diagnostic, if I can speak correctly. Um, you can quickly disconnect the hoses. You can um, unbolt the pump from the back of the box. It comes off pretty quickly. Um, and then you can throw a new one on if you need to. This hose right here is not connected yet. This is where your dipstick assembly is going to go on. So you're gonna slide that hose over. The rest of the hose is gonna go out the side of the box. Um, whenever we're shipping these, we have these partially disassembled, just a very quick um, ease to put together uh, whenever you receive it. If it's something that you're picking up here, we'll put all that stuff together for you. So you don't have to worry about that. Um, the, I'm sorry, let me go over the rest of the components in the box here. So inside we have the charger right up in the top corner there. That's a NOCO charger. It's a charger and a battery maintainer. So you can just leave it plugged in. Um, it'll fully charge your battery or it'll just maintain it so that you don't have to worry about it getting too low, especially over winter storage. Uh, your battery won't go bad that way. Uh, these do need to be charged. So we have the port for charging it on the outside of the box. So you don't need to leave the box open to charge it. You can leave all your items locked up. We have the port here. It has the rubber silicone cover going over it. And then you just open that up. You plug in to 110 volt outlet, nice and easy. The power switch is right here. Just flip that up to turn the system on. Whenever you turn that on, it'll tell you what your uh, battery voltage is. It has a little charge meter right here. So you know how much power you have left on the system. And then we have vents on both sides of the box just to make it nice, keep it cool inside the box. Um, or if any chemicals get in there, it'll vent out chemicals as well. The wand that comes with it is this PVC wand here. It comes with a J-Rod assembly where you get your four different size nozzles that quickly disconnect and you pop on to the next one for whichever size you need. It has a quick connect at the bottom of your gun so you can disconnect it and wind up your hose easily. And then the dip tube assembly, let me grab it here. It's just like so. Again, this might come partially assembled whenever you receive it, and then you just have to screw a couple things together. Um, your hose is going to pop on right over here. You'll use a clamp to secure that. That clamp's included. And then the area down here where the filter is, that's the part you're going to drop down right into your tank. So if you have a nice tall tank, you can use the tube. If you have a shorter tank, because we never know sometimes what size tank you're going to be using, you can actually just eliminate one of these here and use it shorter if you'd like. The check valve that's in here just holds chemical in place um, so that uh, if for whatever reason something malfunctions, you don't have water going back into your tank. And then whenever you lift this up out, any uh, fluid that's still in your hose isn't gonna all drain out through this filter. This, the check valve will hold everything in place. So um, we use this soft wash box assembly in a lot of our builds, um, especially in open trailers or on some of these skids. It's a very versatile type of system. Um, so it can be used in, a, in quite a few different ways. You can flip and turn it in different directions. Um, we have the assembly available with just the box and a different uh, item number if you wanted to go with just the box and put a hose reel somewhere else. So lots of different ways that you can work with this. If you have any questions, take a look at our website. There's a little bit more information on the website about it. It's 3rpressurewashers.com. Um, or you can give us a call or shoot us an email.